Our brains are great. It allows us to solve puzzles, learn from experience, and come up with new ideas. However, the way we perceive things and the way we think can also be wrong. For example, these lines are parallel, and these two wolves are the same color. Our brains evolved not to be as objective and right as possible, but to survive. And this means we will often be wrong and see lions when there is in fact nothing. Knowing that our thoughts can be wrong is very important and sometimes liberating, especially when it comes to thoughts that make us feel bad. For example, you may have a fleeting thought that someone was dry or mean at you at school because they don't like you, when in fact, they may just be having a bad day because they had a fight with their parents. This is an example of an automatic thought that makes you feel bad. It is important to recognize and confront automatic thoughts like this one for two main reasons. One, thoughts affect your feelings, and bad thoughts can make you feel bad. Two, your incorrect thoughts can make you act in a way that is often unhelpful and will ultimately hurt you, like being defensive or isolating yourself. It is therefore very important to recognize and evaluate your own thoughts and challenge them, coming up with more realistic and useful alternatives. You may even want to put your own negative thoughts to the test. Hey, I thought you were acting kind of strange this morning. Is something wrong? Yeah, sorry. It's just that my parents have been fighting a lot lately. I'm sorry to hear that. My parents fight sometimes too and it sucks. Wanna talk about it? These are the things to remember. One, we all make thinking errors. What we think is true is often not. Even when we think and feel that something is very real, it may in fact be wrong. Two, some wrong thoughts can make us feel bad and make us act in ways that may be unhelpful. Therefore, it is important to evaluate your own thoughts Turn them upside down. Look at them from another perspective. Confront them with evidence. And come up with a conclusion that may be closer to reality. Try to keep this in mind the next time you have a thought that makes you feel bad or act in an unhelpful way. Take a step back and evaluate what you're thinking. Can you think of automatic thoughts that made you feel bad or act in an unhelpful way lately? Share your comments below and thanks for watching.